Dozens of people fill Rollover Pass fishing Sunday afternoon. Rollover Pass is a great place, but you got to be safe. This strong current, one of the only reminders from the scene early Saturday morning. There was a fire truck with a spotlight in the water and there were helicopters circling around. Searching for a 31 year old man. Officers say jumped into the choppy waters, intoxicated about 1230 AM. It was really, really rough that night. The current had just, the tide had just shifted. Rick Ferguson says he saw the man with two friends, heard them say someone was in the water and called 911. By the time we got down here, one of his buddies had already walked across, said that the last time he saw him was on this side going underneath the bridge. Uh, and by the time he got to the other side, they had lost sight of him. A spokesperson for the Coast Guard says they started looking by air and water, but the current was too strong for a dive team. The current here is so bad that, you know, you get pulled underneath that bridge. There's so much debris under that bridge for where the old bridge collapsed. Rescue crews called off the search by noon Saturday. No sign of the young man. Sunday evening, officers say someone fishing spotted his body. Poor, you know, just poor guy. Leaving the people here. You just got to be careful what you do. Thinking about more than what's on the end of their line. I mean, people need to be careful out here. Uh, this water is nothing to play around with. Dangerous water has left family and friends without a loved one. In Bolivar, Haley Bull, KFDM 6 News.